welcome back to We Watch Movie. I'm Mike, and I said, God damn! Got great fucking news for you today. Jay's not here because he got his third case of crabs this month, and he cannot be here because it's getting really, really bad. It's getting itchy and scratchy and all sorts of things. There's a sore, and no one knows what's going to happen. So, there's hives, there's there's hives, and there's crystals, and there's, it's a whole new form of, of crabs that no one understands yet. So, um... It's probably from men, they say, and dogs, and it's a mixture of like a man-dog beast, and it usually comes from doing lots of heroin with uh, male hookers. Anyways, good news today is that Halloween is coming the fuck back. We've gotten our hearts broken several times. We thought they were going to make Halloween Returns, which the talent that they had bringing in to write that shit was of like the Saw 19 variety, so no one was totally excited, but the idea sounded kind of interesting, and then they dropped the rights or whatever, they moved companies, and no one knew what the fuck was going to happen with Michael. There was even talks that they were going to do a fucking TV show, which was weird. But now, Blumhouse Productions, which is a good thing and a bad thing because they do really good movies sometimes, but they're also responsible for shit like The Darkness. But the good news is, is that they bought part of it. They're teamed up with Miramax and the Akkads and all sorts of stuff like that. They're gonna bring Michael back. We're getting new Halloween movies. Fuck yes! It's happening! It's fucking happening! We're finally gonna get new Halloween movies. It's for real this time. There's no broken hearts about it. And the best part is, is that they're bringing back the man named John Carpenter himself. Not as director, unfortunately, but as executive producer. He's gonna be the creative director of the whole goddamn project. And that makes your tingleberries go num num and it feels good deep inside your cockles of your heart because he's going to oversee the whole thing and he may even be providing a score for it maybe even providing the score for it which is absolutely out of this world fucking awesome and he even said he even knocked rob zombie a little bit for doing the blasphemic job he did to michael and Halloween 2, that Michael should have never had an origin story, Michael should have never been a character, Michael's always been this fart in the wind, dark, unstoppable whisper, not fart in the wind, but you know what I'm saying, like a, a force of the wind that's totally unstoppable, and he's going to bring it back to this dark, just evil fucking force, and I am so excited deep in my pants, I cannot tell you how excited I am in my pants. Um, it feels good. So we're all really excited about that, and the new news that came out just recently today is um, that... He's going to get, they're looking to get Oculus director Mike Flanagan, who's had a couple of fucking duds, um, but he also did Oculus, which is a pretty good movie. He seems to have really good chops as a director, and he's done some stuff that just kind of was whatever, but Oculus was good, and the guy's got his own style and his own flair, um, so that's good. So they might be bringing in a hardcore really, really visionistic fucking director in to do this, so it's all good things. All good things coming from Blumhouse and Miramax or whoever the fuck has something to do with it. Really fucking excited, guys. Comment down below. What do you think? Are you excited? Is this great news? Is there anything that could possibly be wrong with this news? Because honestly, I don't see anything wrong with it. I can't find a single thing that's bad about this news. I've looked at it. I've gone over it. And I can't see anything that could possibly turn out you know, catastrophic about this. It all seems really, really fucking awesome. So comment down below. Let me know what your all's thoughts are. If you're new to the channel, click that subscribe button and get some goddamn wham up in you.